This is Neil Osterweil with the Global Medical News Network. I'm here at, in Orlando, Florida at ASCO 2009. Dr. Eric Van Kuxen and colleagues report that about 20% of gastric cancers carry the uh, HER2 receptor and that trastuzumab is effective in these patients. Uh, Could you tell me, please, uh, about the study and the significance of it? What we did in the study is uh, it was a randomized phase three study. We randomized patients that ex overexpressed their two receptor um, between chemotherapy, classic reference regimen, fluoroprimidine, uh, and it was 5-FU or capecitabine in combination with cisplatin, um, um, uh, plus or minus uh, trastuzumab. And this treatment was for patients with a two receptor. We um, uh, we looked at patients that had uh, three plus on immunochemistry or a fish positive uh, tumor, and uh, we found that in approximately 22 percent of the patients uh, with advanced gastric cancer, they express a two receptor. And in this group of patients, when treated with trastuzumab in combination with chemotherapy, uh, we've shown that there was a, a clearly significant survival benefit. Um, the median survival went up uh, from 11.1 to 13.8 months, almost three months uh, longer median survival. And the hazard ratio uh, was 0.74, or translated, this means that there was a 26% lower chance of dying of uh, gastric cancer uh, when patients were treated with a combination of chemo uh, plus herceptin uh, uh, compared to patients treated uh, without trastuzumab. And where do you go from here? Well, this is an important study because it's uh, a praxis-changing study uh, because it shows that uh, um, it's the first biological that improves the survival in patients with gastric cancer and it's uh, uh, in a targeted uh, population in utilized treatment. From here we can go in different uh, steps. Um, we can look in the benefit, uh, the potential benefit in the adjuvant setting. There are no studies yet. They are not yet complete, uh, concretely planned, but that could be an option. Or also we could look um, in a build this as a new backbone in the two positive patients and to combine to look at new drugs uh, to further improve the outcome. Because now in this study we have a median survival close to 14 months. Uh, there's still a long way to go and we don't cure yet the patients with advanced gastric cancer. It's a step forward, an important step forward, a practice changing uh, step. But we have to do much better and, and that are two options. So that's the adjuvant as an example or a backbone, a new backbone uh, in future trials in our two positive patients. For Global Medical News Network, I'm Neil Osterman.